Hey right guys, Tradepoint is Joe and today we are watching and reacting to episode 22 of Friends Season 6. Getting very close to the end of the season now uh, already, which has gone by super quick for me, but I've really enjoyed it. And the last episode we had, what, Bruce Willis was in it, being Elizabeth's dad, so that was another nice cameo, <laughs> surprising cameo. Uh, like I said in the last reaction, the only cameo that I know is coming up is Brad Pitt, and I've, I've known that for years that he was in the show, because obviously that's how... Him and I'm assuming that's how him and Jennifer Aniston met. Anyway, I'm pretty sure I heard that. So uh, that's the only one I know. So when it's like Bruce Willis popping up and Ben Stiller, it's always a nice surprise. Um, but yeah, episode 22, guys. If you enjoy, remember to leave a like. If you're new, remember to subscribe. And if you do want the early and uncut reactions to Friends, then link to Patreon page will be in the description. And one of the comments down below where there should be uh, around almost 10 episodes into season seven by the time this one's on YouTube. Uh, Twitter and Instagram will be down below as well if you want to follow me on either of those. But for now, let's do this. So the helmet pelts exhibit at the Morgan Chase Museum. Now you're thinking you got to sleep with him. <laughs> no. No, it's just that he gave me three tickets and there are six of us. Mm. Don't give up my ticket. Me too. <laughs> that was okay, hard. so generous. And I think Ross is generous too. Great. Okay, then it's just us girls. Great. Hey, yeah. day out. Uh, come on. Going to the exhibit with Phoebe. Lesbian love scenes interspersed with video games and free sandwiches. And, uh, Joey gonna be interested. Man, <laughs> <laughs> unlucky. Hey. Hi there. Hey. hey, Ross, listen. Chandler got you out of going to the Lesbian Sandwich Museum this weekend. <laughs> the Lesbian Sandwich Museum. <laughs> think about all the money that you're gonna make. Why? What? Well, her we father go. pays you for babysitting, right? Oh. There it is. <laughs> right. I love that these last three apps are just bully Ross. <laughs> I mean, that in that the whole show. Looks like I'm not the only one interested in fossils, huh? Ah. Hey, Ross, all that does is remind us that you are interested in fossils. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, here we uh, go. <laughs> not, not the singer. Sweet nothings in his ear, huh? <laughs> And Bruce Willis. There's no way he heard that. He just walked in. Oh come on, you guys. That's funny, you know, because he's gonna. He's got like a hearing aid. Ah, uh, no, he's... no, he definitely heard that one. That's that's he's all old. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, bro. <laughs> yeah, he's, I thought he was about to run. Elizabeth and I are, are both adults, and so I don't think there's really anything you can do about it. I'll call the university and it's tell them Bruce about your relationship and have you fired. Oh, a man with they a already, plan. They already know that. I th they already threatened to fire him. <laughs> I mean, first. Star of a new TV show. Show me in the TV book. Oh, well, oh, it's not on TV yet. Well, then it's not on the wall yet. <laughs> Okay. Fine. I mean, I it's his place. Um, now, do you have any of Matt Lauer's clothes here? Maybe? Just ones that haven't been cleaned yet? <laughs> uh, and, yeah, and it is. Yes. yes, the Lesbian Sandwich Stopping Museum. He said he has a big surprise plan. Oh, wow. What, do you think maybe he's going to tell you he's gay? <laughs> <laughs> what? No. What? What? No reason. That would just be a really big surprise, right? It would be a big surprise, I guess. But... Getting married? I'm, I'm not even engaged. No, but there's a two-year wait, and then what if you get engaged in so two in years, and then you've got to wait another eight. two years for this place? That's four Don't years. Well, I mean, I guess there is no harm in putting my name down. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to do it, too. <laughs> Me, too. <laughs> yes, Phoebe. I don't know. I don't have anyone right now. You know. Maybe oh, Rachel. Well, she's gonna marry Bruce sorry Willis. For me. At least my boyfriend isn't gay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> How is that even a zinger? It's not. Russians. It showed them as terrorists and villains. Okay, okay. Look, you, 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 you got Harrison. F that was like every show back. At... Have you seen Twenty Four? Yeah, Twenty Four. I think villains were. What do we have? We had China, Afghanistan, and Russia. They were the three villains in Twenty Four. Every season. <laughs> uh. But people say that my eyes. Do, uh, do you want to make out? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just stop talking. Just thinking about your father. Well, uh, whatever yeah. works for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, so we have to hide our relationship from one more person. Big deal. Yeah, Bruce Sucks. Willis, That's though. Fine you brought protection, right? Why? Are there like bears or something? <laughs> God. <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, what a goofball. Do you want to ride around town on my little pink bicycle? 
A little bit. <laughs> yeah, I kind of want to see that, to be fair. Ross on a pink bike. You get in the hot tub and I'll meet you there. Oh, okay. How long before Bruce Willis shows up? This is going to be like a whole thing. Well, that looks like a builder. Yeah, here he comes. He's going to come out from the ceiling. Such a beautiful house. Thank you. Wait. Oh, is it Rachel? Oh, I think it's Rachel and Bruce. <laughs> if you're listening to this message, we're probably screaming. Yeah, we are. Oh, wait, it's going to be about the thing. Hi, this is Hildy from the Morgan Chase Museum. Yeah. Having the Bing Geller wedding in our facility. <laughs> it is available. <laughs> On this. Oops. Sorry. Oh, I didn't even... no, 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 big bear. Big bear. It took me a minute to process that. <laughs> How does he get himself into these situations all the time? I need ice. <laughs> okay. Thank you. You're right. Okay. You and your eyes. Oh, like you didn't hear that. Maybe he is deaf. Did you really hear a bear? Oh, God. <laughs> I can't be honest. <laughs> you go, Lang. Uh, oh, look, Lisbeth's here. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you talking to? Uh, you guys? What are you doing here? <laughs> wow. <laughs> did you, did you <laughs> Much. Do, oh, I wouldn't do it in there. Um, that's my dad's bedroom. Ooh. That's your that's your dad's bedroom. Oh, God. This is gonna be stressed. That's your dad's bedroom. <laughs> Everyone's traumatized. Okay. See you later. I'm calling uh, for Monica Geller. Oh no. Yes. <laughs> this is Chandler Big. This is Chandler Big. No. <laughs> Stress. You know there are two people who could get your picture up there. Uh, oh, really? <laughs> well, maybe you and I go out for drinks. You're the other one, right? <laughs> he'd really... He's going to go on a date with someone just to get his picture on. He's jolly. Obviously, he will. Get me something from the car. What do you need from the car? Surprise me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at least she's trying to actually save Ross from less admitted death. He's going to go in the bedroom. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Go, bro, run! <laughs> oh. Oh, he slinked like down. Great. Neat guy. A neat guy. <laughs> Even he's like, what? You are the man. I'm just a love machine. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Bruce. <laughs> Yo, he's a psychopath. I mean, he has no ground to stand on now, does he? Ross just witnessed that. I when he totally freaked out and I can't find him anywhere. What are you going to do? Well, I'm never going to listen to you state. again, that's for sure. Here it is. Oh, Joey, why did you son sign a son bitch. of a bitch? <laughs> wow. If I didn't do that, who would have done that? Son of a bitch. Okay, maybe it's It's not even guy. framed like all the others, what? He went out with my wife. Joey. Oh, well, <laughs> yeah, that changed the story a bit. Of course. Why have you gone from there to there? I'll meet you at the front door. Just Which you should have done the first there. time. Okay, Why do we? I don't even bother. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. I need another soda. Um, all that for nothing. What in heaven's name are you doing here? <laughs> Rachel's great this up. And that is why we cannot see each other anymore. Nice, yes. What a save. You and I are going to have to have a little talk. Daddy, he tried that okay. move. I didn't know he was here. But you and I are, are not all that different. I mean, here we go. He's going to call him out on the thing. I, too, am a neat guy. Mm. <laughs> I'm going to say you have some leverage. I'm just a love machine. Ah, there you go. <laughs> Rachel's so confused. <laughs> oh, bro. Ross. Welcome to the family. Let me show you where the guest room is. <laughs> Breathe, so Chandler. 
Please stop freaking out. A woman named Hildy called and said we were getting married, but that happens every day. <laughs> <laughs> I love how old Chandler needs outbursts like that sometimes. Okay. Really? Just propose, bro. Yeah, so that really doesn't mean anything because you know that I'm just not ready. I know. Okay, first. I know. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah, I'm ready. Hey, did she buy it? Totally. So did you oh. show you the place? Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, that's good, my guy. That's Monica to marry you. What? I know. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? My baby came out. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, no. Chandler, my boy. You know what? When he said he wasn't ready, I was like, I don't kind of buy that. <laughs> no, no, I quit a long time ago. Did he? Did I forget to tell you that? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's cool, I was gonna fire you anyway. Great! <laughs> I'm, I'm glad they bought that up as well. Oh, Chandler, my boy. That'll be the big finale then. He's gonna. What do we have? Three episodes left? So, either ep. What ep was this? 22. So, I'm gonna go ep 24 or 25 is he's gonna propose. And then we'll have the wedding next season. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh. That's mad, <laughs> my boy. Because you, you kind of... I look back at like older Chandler where like his whole... It wasn't his whole, but a big part of his personality was not wanting to commit to anyone. So the fact he's like ready to propose. Character development, guys. <laughs> uh. Yeah, because when he said he wasn't ready, I was like, okay, fair enough. But also, I feel like he would be ready like it's been how long would it have been almost two years since they first got together in the obviously not for me it's been like a few months but uh for their timeline it would have been about two years which for me still sounds a bit too soon to propose to someone but i mean they're happy why not i don't, I don't see i think at this point in the show it's like you just have to have chandler and monica end up together and surely you have to have Ross and Rachel end up together. I said since episode one of season one that I'm pretty sure I've heard of Ross and Rachel my entire life. So there's no way that Ross and Rachel don't end up together at the end of the show. But Chandler and Monica, I feel like because they've been so consistent for two seasons now, Ross and Rachel haven't been. You can't just break them up now. I, we don't need a whole storyline of them to like seeing other people or some shit. Uh, I mean, we'll see. Friends could really do that because we know plenty of shows that drop the ball with some storylines. So uh, time will tell on that one. But I just I don't buy that they're not going to be together for the rest of the show. So him ready to propose is awesome. I'm excited for that. Uh, I like proposal scenes. I remember the one from The Office. I'm like, yes. <laughs> that was a good one. I haven't seen many proposal scenes in sitcoms, to be fair, though. It's like the only one I can think of is The Office because I just don't watch sitcoms. So curious how they do on this one. But other than that, this was a really good episode. I think the Ross and Rachel team up, as always, is always strong. But they were really, really good. <laughs> when she went down to pick the grape, pick up the grape, and he was just under the sofa, that literally took me about three seconds to process what I was actually looking at. I thought, like, there's no way Ross is actually shoved himself under the sofa, but now he had. And then we have Bruce Willis. Uh, doing whatever that was in front of the mirror, but yeah, very, very good episode with that one. And then we had Joey trying to get his picture on the wall, which was the fine part of the episode. I, I wouldn't say that was that bad, it was still fine, um, but nothing, not not the standout of the episode. It was definitely Chandler at the end and Ross and Rachel. So yeah, rating, I'm going to go a, I'll, I'll go 8.5. Eight point four out of ten for this one, I think. I think if the Joey stuff was a little bit better, I could have gone for a high rate, but uh, the Joey stuff wasn't that great. It was, it was fine. So yeah, we'll go eight point four out of ten. But excited for the next three now. I'm gonna go prediction. He proposes in episode. I'm gonna go. I don't know. I'll go with the finale because like the last episode because. I feel like the next episode and the one after, you want to end strong. Like, we ended, obviously, season four with the altar and then Chandler and Monica hooking up. Ended the the last scene, the last season was Rachel and Ross getting married. So I feel like the last scene of this season has to be Chandler proposing. 
and Monica obviously saying yes. Imagine if she says no. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way she'd say no. But uh, yeah, that has to be like the last scene. I feel like there'll be some like hiccups in the next episode and the one after that. Otherwise, why would you not just propose in the next episode? We'll see. We'll see. But thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know, you thought, let me know what you thought of the episode down below in the comments. And if you do want the early and uncle reactions to friends, then link to Patreon page will be in the description. And one of the comments down below, like I said, by the time this one's on YouTube, uh, Patreon should be quite a few episodes into season seven now. And I'll see you next time for episode 23. Until then, take care. Peace.